doing my paint by number peeps. Okay, I have another paint by number to discuss today. And this one is from Canvas by Numbers. Now I've mentioned them in the past, but because of COVID-19, I wanted to order something from them and see if they are still holding true to what I've experienced in the past. It's been probably eight or nine months since I've ordered from them. And I just wanna see if their quality is still there or if it's even higher now and whatnot. So this is the image that we're gonna to discuss today. And I'm actually gonna put a picture of him right here. Look, how cute is that? Oh, so cute. All right. So what do we have here? We have our vacuum sealed paints, which I love because that keeps them from drying up and it keeps them from spilling in shipment. So that's fabulous. And here are gonna be the tacks that go with the frame when we do assembly for that. So I'm gonna set these aside because I'm not doing these today. I don't have space for it right now while we're packing and moving. We have our little paint brushes and our hanging hardware back here. And these are gonna go in my box as well or on the floor where I dropped them. And then we have a little paint palette, which is cute. I've never seen one of these added to an order before, which, but I like it because it's a little handy tool to mix your paints with um, if you need to do that, or if you like to scoop them out and use them from here. Um, but that's a nice little touch. But for right now, let's open up this canvas and check out these paints. Point out a couple things right off the bat. Very smooth canvas. So I will be um, using clear gesso over the top but I want you to notice it's got yellow letters and numbers. They're very visible, but they're not gonna be a nightmare to cover, I don't think. We're gonna swatch some of these paints, so we're gonna check it, but that is fantastic. I'm super excited about that. All right, we have our black and white reference guide, hella freaking Luya. And, um, and let's open paints and check these out real quick. When I buy or get sent an, uh, any paint by numbers or diamond painting, I save a photo of the painting in a file on my phone. I make an album called paint by numbers. I make an album called diamond paintings so that everyone I order will go in one of those folders. So when I go back later and I'm looking at a painting, I'm like, I have 70. So how do I know if I've already bought it before or if a company has already sent me one like that before? So I go back into my albums on my phone and I look to see if I have it already. It also helps me keep an inventory of what I've got. As I complete one of those projects, I will take it out of that paint by number album or that diamond painting album and I will put it in a completed artwork album on my phone. I have been dying to get my hands on this painting. I know it sounds ridiculous, but he's just so stinking cute. I couldn't help myself. All right, so let's test some of these paints. I'm not gonna talk during this part. I will actually fast forward it, but I'm gonna test a few, see how they are, see the qualities there, see if they're creamy and all that jazz. Um, some of these, I'm a little terrified that they're gonna be super transparent because of the way they look, but I'm gonna try them out anyway. because I'm using this crappy paintbrush, uh, I'm not getting a real smooth texture, but it's it covered, I mean, really nicely. So, wow. Mm. Guys, be careful opening these up because they are creamy. Such a perfect consistency that I'm over here making a mess. That red is covering like nobody's business. 
that covered that so beautifully. Oh my God, I love it. Okay, so I'm back. I've done swatches on all my colors and you guys notice I'm just going ahead and doing all my painting for now. Um, I have not gessoed this with the clear gesso yet. I have not added any flow aid to my paint. I know I say that every time when I'm doing a review, I don't do those things. I try to test it exactly as it is and that's why I don't gesso it first and I don't add flow aid. These paints are super creamy. So, I had ordered the Color Soul Tiger, which you guys have seen me use in many videos before now, and the paints were really nice. Um, but I think that they have even taken, taken those paints up like five notches because they're super creamy. They've got more opacity. Um, I think I only had four that are not opaque out of the 24, but the paints are super creamy. So my thinking on this is, First of all, this is a legit company, Canvas by Numbers. I will put the link in the description for those of you who don't know where the description is. I have a video about where to find the links that I give you each time. And um, so make sure you watch that video, but this link will be in there. I am super impressed as always, and I cannot wait to get this little booger done. Okay, guys, I hope you've enjoyed this and I hope it was helpful and I hope it helps you trust Canvas by Numbers because they're fabulous and their customer service is wonderful. So um, that's it for today. Have a wonderful day. You guys stay safe. Don't be out there without wearing your masks and stuff. I'm just kidding. I'm not getting on that soapbox. All right, <laughs> I will see you back soon. Thank you as always for watching.